All right, so we're gonna be getting all the stuff painted up. As you can see, and I'm using the GoPro currently to do this. So uh, I'm gonna get you guys set up, and we're gonna get all this stuff primed. So here we go. I'm not the greatest painter, so I try my best. But uh, 
Anyway, at least it's all primed. I'm just gonna go back and I'm gonna have to dry and sand off some of the runs and then reprime it again really quick. But like I said, I'm not the greatest at priming or painting, so it's probably the best. I just gotta wait and then flip them over and do the other side. So, besides this, we're gonna start painting it. So, stay tuned for the painting. Alright, so as you can see, I started painting some of this stuff. This what such as that goes in the death wheel. That's gonna be yellow. And the death wheel here is painted. Um, so now I guess I'm gonna start painting some of the stuff black. What's gonna be black is this. For the depth wheel, that's gonna be black. That's gonna be black. That's gonna be black. As well as the back of the moon board's gonna be black. And the around the outside the depth wheel is gonna be black. So it kind of looks like like a tire almost, kind of like on the tractor on the 318. Now this looks like like that. It's gonna look like a tire, it's gonna be kinda cool. So, we're gonna get you set up here. I only have a little bit of black. So I'm not gonna do it a whole lot, but I'm gonna try to get at least these three here. With one coat on at least on one side. So, if I have enough, I'll go ahead and do the, start doing the back of the mold board. But, I don't know about that. But I guess we'll find out. So, I'm gonna get you set up here and we'll get it painted here. and it should look sharp. These look pretty good. These have to just dry and I'll flip them over and do the other side. And these are here are gonna be green as well as this is gonna be green. We just have to get some green paint and then I'll do those and those will be done for the first coat. And I gotta figure out how I'm gonna take this off so that I can paint that. I've done quite a few coats of yellow, and I say that's pretty good. Not sure if you can see it there.
but it's a little yellow in here now. And it feels like it's very dry and smooth. So that should be good for that. I just gotta figure out how I'm gonna tape that off, which probably just gonna use a bunch of blue tape. I don't know how else to do it, so but uh just gonna do all this will be black out here, so I might have messed up and I painted that over there um, all yellow. But if some of it has to be black, it's not hard to go over black or anything to go over black with anything. So I'm just going to figure out how I'm going to paint this. I mean, maybe if I'm careful enough, it won't run through, but you can't really guarantee that. So I'm probably just going to go on the other side and just put some blue tape right here and call it good there and maybe some around this edge here and we'll probably get that painted so with the first coat as much as I can that's gonna be a little bit tricky to paint because it's round I'm gonna have to paint the um like the, around the edge and then I'll have to paint under here or vice versa, I might paint under here first. But that came out pretty good so far with the primer. You can see a little tiny bit of yellow came through, but nothing major. <coughs> so, anyways, I'm gonna probably get start taping that off, and then I have some black left, so I'm surprised I had enough to do this. <laughs> but. I'm going to have to get more anyways for another couple of coats on stuff, so no big deal. So uh, I'm going to get this taped off, and we're going to probably do this, so here we go.
I think that came out pretty good. And hopefully the taping that I did actually worked. <laughs> so probably the next thing I'm going to show is whenever I get the green here and we paint everything green. All well, the rest of the stuff green. So it shouldn't be too long into that. Hopefully I get the green today. It should, but anyways, that looks pretty good for one coat of black. <laughs> that doesn't look too bad. It's going to need a couple more coats. Everything I want to give at least three coats, I think, because, you know, just to protect it really well. So once those dry, I'm going to flip them over and do the other side. And it's starting to come together now. It's starting to get all painted and look nice. And after it's all painted, the next step's going to be putting it all back together again. So this could be fun. <laughs> but it shouldn't be too bad, hopefully. So I'm just going to paint everything green. So that's going to be the next part. And stay tuned for that. All right. So as you can see, everything's painted now. And... I apologize for not getting any of the green, but my dad just decided to go and ahead and do it, which is alright. <clears throat> Gets the project done quicker, and he can paint better than me, so. <laughs> but uh, anyways, that's how the green looks. I'm going to go and turn some lights on here, give me a second. Okay, so, you know, that looks pretty nice so far, actually. I like that. And I think we're going to start, right after this dries, we're going to start putting it back together again. Because we're going to end up, you know, scratching stuff up a little bit anyways. So it's easier to just put it together and then touch it up after you're done. And I'm probably going to use the GoPro and put it somewhere in here and do like a time lapse. Maybe I'll stick it over there. On top of those steps or something. And do a time lapse. That'll be kind of cool. Of putting it back together so anyways I think it's looking good so far I gave everything I know I could have blocked about a half an hour ago so and that's only one coat of green actually or that stuff and last night I ordered stickers or decals whatever you want to call them to put on here on each side so wherever those come in then obviously they're gonna be put on and I'll finish it off and it looks sweet. So I think that's about it for this part. So hope you enjoyed the priming and painting portion. And it's crazy how much priming and just primer actually for made it look much better. But now that's painted and everything. And it's going to be time to put her back together here really soon. It's going to look, I think this thing's going to look so sweet. Compared to what it used to. <laughs> so, anyways, I'm just rambling on now. So, hope you enjoyed the, this part, and thanks for watching.